this series, What Inspires Us. So when I thought about where would I start this series on what inspires us. So in that first episode of What Inspires Us, I used music as the topic because I thought that'd be an easy one to start with as we all have songs that inspire us. And the topic for this episode might be just as easy. Things we've watched that inspire us. So think TV, movies, and events. Now I remember as a kid watching television, and television back then only had about a dozen channels, and that was if you were lucky enough to have UHF where you lived. And when you wanted to know what was on TV, you just consulted the guide, the TV guide that came in the mail every week. And amazingly enough, with only a dozen channels, there always seemed to be something on to watch. Now I loved anything science fiction or space related, and one of the earliest shows I remember was called The Thunderbirds. Now you can still find this show on streaming services today, and admittedly watching it now, it seems a little bit silly. But back then, as a young kid, I wanted to be like the Thunderbirds and fly those cool machines. I also grew up in a time where I was able to watch men land on the moon. And I think those sorts of things helped inspire me on the career path that I would eventually choose. And who doesn't have a movie or two that inspires them? So sticking with that career path thing, when I graduated from college in 1986, that's when Top Gun came out. And I was just beginning what I hoped was my path towards becoming a naval aviator. So talk about getting a little inspirational boost from a movie. Man, that was great because not only did it give me a boost, but I could tell people, that's what I'm gonna go do. And what about watching the movie Rocky? You gotta be inspired for everyone who's ever been an underdog when you watch that movie. See, things we've watched have the ability to stir emotions in us just like music did. Very powerful emotions. I mean, you can't watch the 92 Olympics with Derek Redmond and not feel inspired to get up anytime you want to stay down. When the easiest thing to do is probably to stay down. And what about the 1980 Olympics, the miracle on ice? Now, I remember watching the last 60 seconds of that, along with millions of other people, I'm sure, half of whom were probably holding their breath and the other half were cheering loudly. And I don't know what was more inspiring about watching that. Was it Team USA's underdog victory? Or was it watching the crowd and how everyone seemed to come together and to be united? I mean, talk about something powerful something with the ability to inspire and to unite a nation. So you can see the things we've watched have the ability to inspire us as well. And it probably creates just as long a list as we did in the music episode. And the beauty of the day and age we live in is you don't have to consult the TV guide to see when they're coming on. You can probably find those things out there on the internet. So do that when you have a chance. Think about something you've watched that inspired you and go find it and go watch it. See you again in the next episode of What Inspires Us.